Hi, my name's Alan Chokley. I'm the mechanical engineer at Cap House Colliery. I'm here to say a few words about our winding engine. The winding engine's over 40 years uh, in situ here, but it wasn't brand new when it came. It was repurposed from, from a, a mine in North Yorkshire area. But it stood the test of time, but now's the time to replace it with a new modern winder. The winder is a convenient way to take people and materials from the surface of the mine way down underground. It cuts a lot of time walking down drifts and using old-fashioned methods. And that's why the winder were invented, because of technology and improvements in getting miners from A to B in a timely fashion. It's basically a, a reel of steel wire cable on a drum lapped long enough to take you from pit top to point of use underground and there's an electric hydraulic motor powering that winding it in and winding it out thus going over a pulley wheel takes you from pit top to underground I'm Alison Cooper, I'm the Collections Engagement Manager Exhibitions in Digital at the National Coal Mining Museum Arthur Lockwood's drawings in the museum's fine art collection of the dismantling of Coventry Colliery winding machinery comes at a pivotal time at Cap House during the upgrade of the 1980s winding engine. They visually demonstrate to you as a visitor the process our winder will be put through, albeit replaced and not dismantled. I particularly like this piece lifting out centre girder from 28th of May 1997. You can see from this that um, there are two members of the workforce attaching a chain onto the crane um, linked up to the, um, the girder and that's going to be lifted out. Arthur's made annotations here and also sketched out another member of the workforce clearly practicing different positions that he's seen actually on site. You can see how skillful Arthur is with his technical drawings and he moves swiftly with his um, mark making, giving us the, the impression that he needs to work quickly to capture this moment in time. 